2020. Win together. A very good evening and a warm welcome to the Mahindra Rajapaksa International Cricket Stadium in Hamman Tota. It is the My 11 Circle Lanka Premier League. A big game, Jaffna Stallions riding the crest of the wave. And Candy Tuskers, they got off the mark. At the toss, Jaffna Stallions winning the toss and they just decided to bat first. They were pretty unanimous about it. And uh, looking at the two teams, well, this is first Jaffna Stallions, full of international experience with uh, Lakmal coming in for Binro Fernando. While the Candy Tuskers, they're going in with an unchanged team again. Look at the star studded lineup. All of them have played their, for their respective country. And yeah, it's going to be a very exciting contest. Jaffna Stallions, obviously. The stronger of the two teams coming into this considering the way on the back of what they're coming in they won games Pereira has been in outstanding form one of Patel starting off with a wide down the leg side not the best start down the track it's dangerous to do that Melinda Sirivartana found that out yesterday a no ball and they're running on it and a direct hit direct hit this is going to be quite tight i think he didn't run in a straight line Ivishka. oh he's out that a straight if he had run in a straight line straight down the wicket he would have got in there he is big screen out massive wicket Ivishka fernando a fantastic player, one of the stars of this Jack Nostallion's outfit, run out off a no ball. Out for three or five balls, 13 for one. Got him. Walk past that, just a little bit of turn. That is an important wicket. Going to run the strikes early. I just derived a method. To surprise the batsman on that occasion it wasn't seam up it was kind of an off spinner worked well 15 to banuka japna stallions in trouble 23 for two tom wars now i think jaffna has the best bowling attack in this uh, competition as we just saw my 11 circle champion shot Bowled him. That is terrific. He's picked up his second wicket now. Now got a wicket in his second. No wonder they're smiling out there, the Tuskers. Well, at the moment, everything is going in Gunaratna's way. You know, he's exploiting the conditions very well. Doesn't contribute again. He's gone for four. Jaffna Stallions deeper in trouble. 35 for three. Shah Malik now. A boundary off the last ball, the over. Nine runs from that over now, so nine overs gone, 47 for three. That does help their cause, that's for sure. More trouble, more trouble. Shoaib Malik doesn't wait for the umpire's decision because he knows. It hit Kamindu Mendis in the fingers and it's gone on to the stumps. Now Batman using his feet, hitting the ball really hard. And the baller did well. Kamindu to get down and get fingers on the ball. Big wicket. How extraordinary. Your partner drives one straight back towards the bowler. Deflection out. You're gone. Malik's made nine. 49 for four now. 97 yesterday. This is a Pereira. That's in the air. Straight down the ground. And a six. Effortless hit from uh, De Silva. Again, offside. Giving himself room. So playing to his strengths. Clubber again, 
goes all the way. Finds a gap, gets another four. It's an expensive one. That's done, that's done. It's a six, the 100 comes up. 50 partnership as well, but Darren Ganga. Look at what the umpire is saying. Oh dear, oh dear, Naveen ul has undone all the good work. We were just praising them. Nicely hit into the gap. Nicely hit once again. And the same result. And he hits them powerfully. So now he's a lot tougher to bowl. He hits them down the ground off the front foot, off the back foot. And Tisara Pereira reaches his 50. And another fantastic innings by the captain. That's a good connection. And it's gone all the way for six. Not by much, but it doesn't have to go by much. Three balls left in the over. That's what happens. Short. Short and a little bit quicker and just uh, eased away for a boundary. Naranja is all on his own, just doing it in his own way. But this on the other hand, just going blasting. That's a great shot. Beautifully controlled for 50. Oh, that's even bigger. That's a terrific shot. It's a beautiful shot. Four and us down. Picked out the fielder. Pereira thought he was in real trouble. Low full toss. Oh, and it's through. Unforced error. Oh, he's picked that up superbly, and that's gone for six. That is a very, very big shot. Running into the skipper. He's got underneath that, and he's hit that many a mile. That's a great way to start the over. That might be out. It is out. Eventually, the wicket falls. He'll be disappointed with himself that he couldn't carry on, but I can tell you that he's done enough damage. He's just making sure that it's a legal delivery. Does he have enough behind the line? Yep. That's okay. I think he's just over the line, so he'll be he'll be disappointed. Out for 68, 167 for five. The Jaffna Stallions. Backing away, give himself some room, and he's out first ball. The Jaffna Stallions would like this. They've just had the set batsman, Tisana Pereira, getting out, and now Dananje deceived. Coach Kandabi knows it. So now the opportunity for the Tuskers at least to redeem themselves because two new batsmen. Don and Jay De Silva gone for 61, 167 for six. Sliced. And four. That's another full toss and it's out. Straight to the man next to cover. Quick little uh, check of uh, the no ball. 50th wicket for Noan Pradeep in T20 cricket, and that's fine. And Dilwan Pereira, the catcher. Wanenda Hasaranga, 5 or 4, 177 for 7. Full toss, hammered away. Really well done, that is outstanding. Good work, but this is really a strong comeback by the Tuskers. When you looked at where the uh, Jaffna Stallions were, 
but they've come back very very strong another look take a look at how he composes himself knows that he's almost at the edge throws it back and then quickly quickly recover so another wicket down for the stallions two balls left slow delivery that time and four runs the result that's hard into the foot into the ground as well i think thought about uh, asking for the catch not to be in the end they might be sending that upstairs to have another look oh yeah straight into the ground that's not even close ground pad straight back up to the bowler Naveen not out so it has to be not out but the good thing for the Tuskers is that they'll take this last three overs with them because they really came back strongly the last three overs 15 runs Everything that Tisara touched turned to goal, 68, and look at the number of balls he's used. Dananjad is silver, equally good, supported him, 61 of 38, and this innings was all about that, and uh, some support at the top by Baduka, 15 of 23. 135 runs scored off the last 10 overs as we look at uh, what the Tuskers did. You can see they used quite a few bowlers, seven used in total. And that wickets column, three for 44 to Naveen Ohaki. Got a little tap early in the end, going at uh, 11 runs and over. Got a little at the death as well, which won't make him very happy. But uh, in the end, wickets are important. Three overs for Gunaratna, two for 20. That's a really good return, going at just over six and a half. And right at the top, Patel, three overs, none for 14, with 11 dot balls, just over 4.5 for that economy rate. That is what's required. 186 runs required. They need to go at 9.3 runs and over, and they're going to have 20 overs to face. The openers they have to bat sensibly. They have to negate any chances of uh, Jaffna Australian bowlers. <laughs> Finds enough bat on this one. It goes high in the night sky, and she flies for six. In the air once again. Will that be taken? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Got underneath it. Hands like buckets. Had to wait and wait, but he always looked like he would be picking that one up. Moment he picks it up off the stumps. Eyes on the ball, right underneath it. I'll take that. The Stallions have struck, and you're right. The partnerships are going down. Six for one. Batted well yesterday, too. Mendes. Picked up nicely. That was sweet as. Goes all the way for six. Uppishly, enough bats. Ariel goes over the infield, gets a boundary. Fielder, fielder, take on, brilliant. And that ball was flying. A very little time for the fieldsman to react. How well he grabbed that one. He's removed. For four runs, it's 24 for two. This guy loves to sweep the ball, whether it's the lap sweep or the slug sweep. Top edge, he gets away with it. That's running away too. The fielders give up the chase. Goes again. Over the boundary, another six in the over. Talk about improvisation. Miscued, miscued, up in the air. Will it be taken? Yes! Cramped him up for room. The catchers are being taken to the relief of the Jaffna Stallions. 
told you this dealing in sixers he was looking upwards trying to hit it skywards it's kusal mendis gone for 20. candy taskers are 47 for three it's a lovely drive through the covers that's gone for four that's a wonderful way to start the over Nice and fine, whipped away with experience for four. That's another My 11 Circle champion shot. Top edge. Should be taken. Comfortably taken. And Candy, Candy Tuskers in trouble. They've lost their fourth wicket. Another look, the short delivery, the top edge wasn't in control at all. And Lakmal absolutely safe on the boundary. Mendes out for nine, it's 70 for four. That's a solid shot. Wonderful boundary. Just using the pace. High in the night sky, taken. Another wicket. So runs, wickets and catches. What more do you want from the captain of the Japan Stallions? Tisara Pereira, underneath it, safe as a house. Let's go, boys. Come on. He'll be disappointed. 46 of 32. It's now 90 for five. The Tuskers. Top edge, top edge, and taken. Another one falls. It's crumbling now for the Tuskers. He's held on to another catch. Prasanna goes. He has the only presence. Tisara Pereira. It's difficult to keep him out of the game. He's handled the situations quite well. Only scored one from three deliveries, 98 for six. Sweetly pulled away. Reverse sweep. Makes good connection. And it will run into the boundary. That will enhance the chances for Candy Tuskers. They haven't given up. In the air, in the air, taken. They're catching everything, and everything they've done has shown results. And that, I'm afraid, might be the chances of Candy Tuskers with Dilruan's wicket gone away or blown away. Good catch. And this is yet another one. Pereira goes for nine. It's 119 for seven. Naveen Ulhaq will need to deliver his best with the bat. That's nicely, nicely done by Naveen. He's off the mark. That's a top edge and should be out, is out. Easily taken, Shumari taking that catch, Hosaranga. He just got the top edge, easy catch. Easy catch for the man of the moment, Usman Khan Shinwari. So that's the end of Naveen Al Haq. Four of three balls, 125 for eight. That's high. Should be taken. It is comfortably taken as the captain again. Geez, in the game, he's taken another catch. That's a basket load of catches he's taken so far in this match. Yeah, I think he's got three tonight. Bowled well and batted well. Serenga Lakmal in the slot. Nuan Pradeep having a go. Caught out at long off. Out for naught. 126 for nine. Skipper's back in. Oh, that might be out. He likes it and so does the umpire. Up goes the finger. Gunnar Ratner has decided to have a good look at it and uh, get the TV umpire involved. I don't think height's going to be an issue because the way he collapses here. 
Probably get teared of a uh, glass eye. There it is. Heading middle stump. Magnificent performance for him. Up goes that finger to wrap things up. So well done to the Stallions. They were in trouble with the bat right at the start, but uh, gee, they recovered absolutely superbly to get that 185 for eight. Another two points. Really good work from the boys in blue. Right, I look back at the match summary. The Stallions, 185 for eight. Pereira was the star. 68 off just 28 deliveries. That's outstanding stuff. De Silva, 61 off 38. And uh, Naveen Huck, three for 30, uh, three for 44, I should say. A little bit on the expensive side, but picked up some important wickets. Gunnar Rutner was really good, two for 20. And the Tuskers in reply, just that figure of 131 with Taylor, the top scorer. And the Stallions getting up by 54 runs with Chinwari. The pick of the bowlers with three for 17 off three overs.